Hello everyone and welcome back to Star Stable Online and we are here getting ready to visit with the Hermit on South Hoof Peninsula and we had a very interesting day last time when we went over with little Madison who was so cute and we helped to rescue her Gimo, her game electronic motor device or something like that from uh, a chicken and I absolutely loved that and now we have brought it over to the Hermit and he is extremely popular for a Hermit by the way I mean look at all of this and he hopefully will be able to repair it for her. So let's go ahead and talk to him and see what we can do. I still don't want to talk to you. Well, we at least can try talking to him. But you knew the answers to my questions. Eh? What's the name of the horse of yours? Rosestone, eh? Well, that's a nice name. Um, I don't blame him for feeling overwhelmed. There's so many people. Oh, look at the Gimo machine that you say is Madison's. If you can prove to me that you are a true rider. You might have just got lucky with those questions. If you can complete my racetrack before the time runs out, then I'll be convinced you're telling the truth. Otherwise, I shan't speak any further to you. In that case, I'll only talk to your horse. Okay? Eh? So you're accepting the challenge? <laughs> Brave. Alright, so let's go ahead. We're gonna ride as fast as we can. Which is not a good thing. <laughs> Rose, don't hang in there! Because she hasn't had a chance to be taken care of for days because we don't have the ability to take care of her needs yet. Oh my goodness, go Rosestone, go! I haven't even been able to race you for a long time either. Oh, hopefully we can do this. Go Rosestone, go! Go Rosestone, go! Go Rosestone, go! Oh my gosh. Alright, we can do this Rosestone. We've got this. Man, he's got a lot of stuff. Okay, we saw that person get tripped up by the barrels, so let's slow down, slow down Rosestone. And run for it. Good. Oh, fudge. We'll have to jump all of these. Hang in there, Rosestone. Go, 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 go. You can do it. Oh, my goodness. If I don't do this, what if I can't fix the Gibo? What if I can't get a wild horse? Come on, Rosestone. We want a new member in the family. We can do this. Oh, da, 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 da. oh can we make it? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> easy there, Rosestone. Easy there, easy there, easy there, easy there. All right. Almost made it over that boulder. Come on, Rosestone. <laughs> this is a hard one. <gasps> All right, there we go. Yes. All right, the race is finished. Man, that one was a tricky one, wasn't it? That was really cool. Okay, so we'll have to come. Man, it's a bit out of the way to go on that race, too. All right, so what does he have to say? Well, knock me down with a feather. What a display. What an outstanding riding technique. All right, so now we need to like reach into the pile of people. All right. That saga was incredible, truly unbelievable. Where did you learn to ride like that? I must say I am impressed, very impressed indeed. Eh? Gimo, yes? Um, it could take a while, so you can leave now. Why? Why are you asking if you can help me out? If I'm not going to be rid of you, then you can try fixing that trough over there. All right, so we're going to help him out, I suppose, uh, with a trough fixing. Okay, so we're going to come over here. Do I need to get... I think I need to get off the horse, don't I? I must use the, the hamar. <laughs> I must use the hamar to fix the trough. So, all right, we're going to help him out. Oh my gosh, that saddle is very pretty. It doesn't really suit Rose Stone's coloring whatsoever, um, but I do like it because it, it looks quite nice. All right, so fixing this with the hamar. All right, let's go ahead and fix this. Here we go. And then do I just like keep pounding? There we go. All right. There, maybe we can help him out with this. All right, let's run back over here. Hey, sorry you're surrounded by people. <laughs> and poor hermit. <laughs> All right. You repaired the trough? Well, knock me down with a feather. I'm sure that that chicken from a couple days ago would have loved to do that, sir. All right. The handy rider. That was a quick repair. A good rider as well as handy. Eh? Are you sure you fixed it? Could you pour water into it without the water running out of it? Eh? Where's the water? Um, you can get water from the pump. Here, you can fill this bucket up with water. All right. So we're helping him out here. All right. Here's bucket and bucket placed. Pump in the water. Rose stone is so pretty. I really do love her. All right, gotta pick up the bucket. All right, I like his house. It's like a cute little old house so much. Oh my gosh, the poor man. Hang in there, Mr. Hermit. 
<laughs> like he's just being crushed between the horses. <laughs> oh, the poor man. Seems as though you've done a good job with the trough. All right, hang in there. I know you're in here somewhere. I just have to find you. Mm. Well, if it was nothing else, then you can leave. I'll look at G the GMO from Madison. Why are you still here? Yes, I heard your question about why I own a trough, but I didn't really know why I should answer you. Hmm? Well, you've no doubt seen that there are wild horses here. Eh? The climate here on South Hoof isn't what you would call ideal for my four-legged friends. The horses here live a life full of hardship, which is why I do, I do all I can to help them. If I don't help, who will? You want to help? You're also fond of the wild horses here? Holy days! This is like a carrot-colored horse. Oh my gosh! I have never seen one of the horses this carrot-colored. Wow! I think the bridle and the, the saddle blanket really bring it out. Okay. All right, Mr. Hermit, I have to talk to you over the color carrot horse pony. I can't really see you, but let's keep going here. Yes, I am fond of the wild horses. Eh? I need to. I have to. Oh, you can just go and tidy the carrot patch up if you have if you have to help. I need to be alone now. I'm so sorry. I, I wish I could give the poor man a little bit of breathing space. I understand. I understand. Oh my gosh, but this carrot patch. I'm so in love with it. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, I need to use the gardening tools. Okay, I love this carrot patch. All right, so we're going to come in. We're going to help out in the garden. Doing a little bit of work. Pruning things. Oh, look, that's the weeds. So we're clearing away the weeds. I get it now. I get it. Okay, so then we'll come over here. Get out of here, you nasty tall weeds. Fun fact, I actually did spend um, quite a long time, a few months, it was about three months of doing work up in the mountains, in the Appalachian Mountains, in an organic flower farm one summer, doing things like this. And it was it was really amazing work. I would have loved it if the bosses hadn't been like, we should never pay you. But it was really hard, and it was really awesome. Um, but it definitely taught me that farming, traditionally, is extremely difficult, especially if you don't give your employees the right tools. So I hope this is a good set of um, of little iron shears. All right, and let's come over here and, all right. Well, knock me down with a feather. That was fast. You're faster than a horse who's, uh, thanks. All right, hang in there, buddy. Hang in there, I understand. I'm an introvert too. Being surrounded by so many people can be very overwhelming. Um. If you can help me out with the wild horses some more. You want to help? Eh? You see, I usually leave food out for the horses so that it's easier for them to get by here. Like I told you, life isn't easy for a wild horse in these parts. The strong winds make it very hard for anything to grow here. Everything just blows away. Eh? <laughs> Sorry if that's annoying. I think it's hilarious, though. <laughs> My question for you is, um... Will you go and place out boxes of food for the horses? You will? Eh? Thanks. <laughs> oh, goodness. All right, hang on a second. People are panicking because I haven't friended them. I understand you so well right now, Mr. Hermit. I promise. All right, so come on, Rosestone. We are going to go and we are going to put out boxes of food for the wild horses. Who knows how much longer before my friend list fills up. All right, so let's come over here. Oh, look how cute! Look how cute! They're just cute, 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 cute boxes of cute carrots. I love them. Uh, all of a sudden, I want to like make them like little clay boxes for the carrots. Um, in real life, no idea why. Inspired by the most random things. All right, so let's leave some carrots out over here. How many carrots are horses? Horses? Sporses? What? Are horses supposed to have though, you guys? I love hearing from you, horse people. You answered my questions about like what you do for your horse when you're out and about looking for water and it, i really love learning so much from all of you so how many carrots are they supposed to really have is it kind of like bunnies where you're only supposed to give them like the tiniest bit of one um if any at all because they can get sick otherwise because i get the feeling i mean if they're like a lot of the other herbivorous hoofed animals then they actually need to eat like a lot more grasses like rough fibers rather than delicious yummy carrots all right and then over here is this a good spot what am i doing over here is that like a carrot spot is that what i'm doing well it's a spot there's something going on oh it's a dalmatian puppy so cute yeah it's definitely a spot so let's see what's going on here oh apparently you can put carrots in that rock all right well that's a little bit of enrichment for them 
so that they'll be able to... Uh, ah, it's so pretty. So that they can dig around. Oh, there's a spot really far away along the coast now. All right, well, let's go. We're going to drop off some carrots all over the place. Wow, let's go up here. It's so pretty. Oh, you guys, exploring in this world is just so much fun. Wow. Wow. I know it's a little bit odd, but I think that South Hoof, rather than the forest, I haven't properly explored the forest yet, so there's a good chance that my feelings will change. But South Hoof is definitely 100% my favorite place right now. I love the vineyards. I love how busy they are, but I love the open spaces. I love the wild horses. I love these purple flowers. They're just so pretty. All right, ah, there it is. There's the last spot we need to leave the carrots. All right, and we'll put them out here. And there we go, lunch boxes for horses. So yeah, South of my favorite place right now. And the music too, the music makes me so, so happy. All right, let's go ahead. Apple Forest, that's a fun name. All right, and we're gonna run back down to the Hermit. Is this the way to the Hermit's place? I'm trying to remember, it's kind of hard up here. Hang in there, Rose Stone. Oh no, I think that his path is like this way. There we go, hang in there, Poppy. I feel like the seals don't enjoy the adventures as much as Thistledown does. So let's come down here and let's talk to the Hermit again. Look how cute. I love how you can change the landscape. Like the things you do as the quest actually permanently change the way the map looks for you. All right, so I need to reach in here and pluck the hermit out. Did it go well? Did everything look okay? Nothing strange took place. Oh, were you expecting something strange to take place, sir? I thought I could hear the horses neighing worriedly through the wind, but as long as you didn't see anything strange, Eh? I've just completed a new racetrack that I'd like to challenge you on. Didn't I already run that? It went well for you on the last track. Oh, there's a new one here. Two of them. That's really cool. But I'd like to see if you can manage this one as well. You can't cheat this time in any case. If you manage to cheat on the last one, you certainly won't be able to on this one since I've just made it. Um, let's me see the true bond between you and Rose Stone. Eh? So are you ready to take on the challenge? Beyond any doubt, you're a brave one, I must say. All right, so here we go. <laughs> oh my goodness. I feel so bad though, because Roastin hasn't been taken care of in so long, but we if we get this done, then we'll be able to take care of her. All right, let's go ahead from this way. All right, where are we going? Oh goodness. Man, this is a sharp one. Okay, jump this. Ooh, 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 slow down, Rosestone, slow down, sweet. Okay, good job. Good job, we've got this. We've got this, all right, come on. Together now. There. It's a bit of a challenge on here, oh man. I can't really see where we're going some of the time either. Is that a spot I have to jump? No? Okay, good. Wow. Wow. It's just so pretty. I love the tree roots. I love the way they reach down. I love the way it gets so dark over here and you just have to like wonder what on earth is going on. All right, come on, Rose Stone. We've got this. <laughs> oh, winding through these trees. It's a little tricky. I have no idea where we're going now. Okay, there we go. Ah, I see it. All right, straight ahead, Rose Stone. Straight ahead. Yeah, I don't think my seal is enjoying this as much as, as Thistledown is used to being jostled around. All right, almost there, Rose Stone. Well, that should make the hermit pretty happy. All right, let's see what he has to say about that. Dun dun dun! The wild track. There we go. All right, and let's come on over here. Slow down with the hermit for just a minute. Knock me down with a feather. You're a fine rider. It's impossible to ride as well as you do if you don't speak the horse's language. Good! So he's liking us. Hang in there, Mr. Hermit. I'm reaching in to pull you out from the crowd. We must speak further about your riding technique, Saga. I loved it, and it was like you were flying there in the saddle with Rose Stone. Oh, we finally got him excited about something. Eh? I'll fix Madison's machine. I'm really quite technical, even if you wouldn't think it to look at me. Eh? 
She can get it back next time. Net time, she's here. <laughs> if you want to compete more on the racetrack, you're welcome to come back. I can keep time w while you ride the tracks. But now I have to do other things. All right. Oh, did we just get a little hat? <gasps> a little fishing hat? Are you kidding me? I want to see my little fishing hat. Come here, little fishing hat. Fishing hat? What? Wait, we still need to do something to get the fishing hat? Until next time? I can't be bothered with you anymore, so you'll have to leave. I need to um, count all the carrots. Goodbye. All right, did I, did I just get it? Okay, what's this? A quest of trust. Interesting. Fishing hat? <gasps> I have a fishing hat! Oh, it's so cute! Look at me! <laughs> There's so many people. Oh my goodness, I can't even see straight. All right, hang on. Hang on, Mr. Hermit. What's this about a quest of trust? Eh? I don't know you very well yet, but if I trusted you a little more, there's a chance I might let you adopt one of South Hoof's beautiful wild horses. All right, so we need to build up our... Um, I do not want to call for a pickup right now. That would be the opposite of what I want to happen. So let's check our stats really quickly. Reputation. So our reputation... Whoopsie-daisy. All right, too many things, too many boxes open. Okay. Reputation. Moreland Stables is admired, which is the highest you can go. So we've done really great on that. Firgrove, we haven't done anything with yet. Keepers of Aiden, still working on. Silverglade, we're popular. Fort Pinta, Silverglade Manor. AAE, Astronomical and Archaeological Society. <gasps> I totally forgot about them. We need to work with them too. Yorvik City Plaza. Here we go. South Hoof. All right. Don't have all that much contact with the mainland. So we need to continue to work our way up. So we're like at 500 and 535 out of it. And I'm being so crowded. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. There's just so many people. Help. Run away. <laughs> so many people. <laughs> Oh, 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 I understand you so well, Mr. Hermit. Oh, I understand you so well. Okay, open space. Breathe deeply, Saga. You're okay. Oh, all right. It's not trying to, like, abandon you guys. I'm just, like, a little overwhelmed. It's a lot of people when I'm trying to do quests. All right. So let's go ahead and accept these. Ooh, so many names. So many names. Here we go. There we go. And let's work our way over. So we're going to head back into the village. And let's see if we can do anything more with the villagers. So we'll let Madison know how things are going. We'll see if we can help them set up anything else here on South Hoof. And then it might just be time, trust, going on the races to build up the racetracks. Um, I don't know like what levels we might need to work on. But I definitely need to take care of Rose Stone too. Not to mention there's still so many things we need to do back on the mainland. Alright, let's see. Yeah, I mean, look at all of that. And we've just kind of, like, completely tossed poor Justin's plate to the wind. Not to mention the poor ghost that's apparently trapped in the castle. So we'll have to check that out. And, I mean, the Archaeological Society? How could I have forgotten the Valley of the Hidden Dinosaur? I would be going to an archaeological dig site. <gasps> that's a wild horse! Or maybe an invisible rider? Okay, that's really cool. But how could I have forgotten the archaeological dig site? Oh, we need to work on that too. Alright, well, let's continue to help out at South Hoof. Because if it's going to be time that's going to take us to set up all the quests, then we definitely want to do everything we can now. Ah, is there nothing more we can do here? There's the chickens. Let's see. I think, let's go see if we can talk to... Um... Let's see. I know there's a couple more people who are kind of hiding over back here. Yeah, I think we can talk to them. So let's see if, what next chapter in the adventures would be ready for us with Holly. Hey, Holly. Hey again, Saga. I hope to be able to catch you up before you rode off. Thanks so much for all your help. I don't know what we would have done if you didn't turn up to save everyone. Have you met my husband, Eric, by the way? You only saw each other very briefly out at Cape Sorrow. Uh, not yet. So let's say hello to Eric now that he's feeling better. Okay, hang on. So sorry, everybody. I'm just trying to do quests. Hi, Saga. Like Holly said, I am Eric. Thanks for saving us. I was really frightened out there on Cape Sorrow, but I tried to put on a brave face for Madison. Now, though, I'm mostly angry. That would have never happened if it weren't for my stupid father. Oh no, we have more father issues! <laughs> Why? Oh dear. As long as nobody other than him gets into trouble, as long as nobody other than him gets in trouble on his little adventures, then I don't care so much. But this time he put my daughter Madison in harm's way. He's taken it too far now. I don't know what I'm going to do, but things can't carry on like this. I'm sorry, Saga. Um, that's okay. I have a cute little fishing hat and I'm here to be a shoulder to cry on. I won't drag you into our family conflicts. Thanks again. I hope to see you again when this is calmed down. 
All right, so that's happening. Is there anybody else like I can talk to? Um, let me see here on Sigrid and the hermit. I don't think we can talk to the hermit. So let's go talk to Sigrid. And then we might be able to figure out, um, Sigrid is his mother, I think. Or no, Sigrid is the husband or the wife of, um, the, the cute little guy who's so sweet and optimistic who's opening up a shop. So I'm pretty sure that's his wife. All right, so let's head over there and talk to her. And then I think that might, that might do it for now. All right, up we go. Ah, oh, so beautiful. It's so beautiful. And then we'll just have to continue to work on building up uh, everybody's abilities here on, or everybody's reputation here on South Hoof Light, or South Hoof area. There's Sigrid. All right, there we go. Um, the missing girl? What? That sounds Hello. serious. No, no, Hello there, Saga. Wonderful to see you again. You wouldn't happen to have seen Madison, would you? No? Hmm. I wonder where she's gone to. See, there aren't any schools here on Salthof, so I've actually taken the responsibility of homeschooling her. My son Eric seems to think we should be sending her to a proper school. Uh, oh. Oh, so maybe that is like Grandma. Bah. As I thought, my teaching isn't good enough. Would you be an angel and have a quick look to see where Madison is? She should be down at the farm. Thanks, Saga. All right, so there's that. And then oh she God, also has... What are you asking me Ooh, for? Sorry, That's yeah. so funny. We like question her about where she could be. Good day to you, Saga. If I understood correctly or understand correctly, you've already been inside the lighthouse. Otherwise, I would have gladly given you a tour. Might you have time to help me out with one more thing? It's to do with the ferry that used to go between South Hoof and Fort Pinta. I'd love to see it going again. What if an accident happens at some point? We need to be able to connect with the mainland in a hurry in that case. I don't know who to talk to on the mainland, but perhaps James and Fort Pinta can help you. I don't know him, but apparently he's the one who calls the shots over there. You're not you're not sure James is the right person to talk to, but you'd be happy to help anyway, you say? Thanks, Saga. I hope to see you again sometime. All right, wonderful. All right, so I think that we have finally set it up so that we will be able to get the ferry running back and forth between Fort Pinta and South Hoof. And we'll go and check for Madison. So I think we'll check for Madison next time. And well, yeah, we'll probably look for Madison next time and then we will head over to Fort Pinta and <laughs> and we will finish up with James and let him know that this area is open and we might even do some things over at Fort Pinta. Definitely take care of Rose Stone. It's been way too long. It's been like well over a week since I've last been able to tend to her at all. So we'll have to definitely take care of that. Wow, that's so beautiful. Yeah, that's so beautiful. And I love this place, you guys. I love this place. So I'm going to do my absolute best. Well, you know what? We're already almost down here. Let's look for Madison. I'm going to do my absolute best to see if we can raise up the reputation and maybe adopt one of those wild horses. And it's just so beautiful. I just can imagine it would smell so good running through over here. All right. Madison? Check with Eric. All right. Let's see. Eric? Ah, Madison? Oh, he knows something. Are you looking for Madison? Yes, I am. But we will have to find her next time. So I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye.